Hey everyone, so I went shopping last night and I went to Shoppers Drug Mart. I had a few things I needed to pick up. And with my points, I had $170 worth of free stuff. And it was built up points. They didn't, they're not endorsing this in any way. None of this is endorsed by anyone. This is all my own money that went into this. I got $200 worth of stuff and I only paid $40. What? Yeah. So I'm gonna go through with you guys what I got minus my hairbrush because actually I can show you guys that first one right here. So this is my hairbrush. Nothing really out of the ordinary. It's by Stylize. It's a comfort brush. It's got a nice sort of gel handle so when you're holding it it conforms to your hand. It's really nice. Doesn't tug. So. I really like that one. Um, next thing I got was my shampoo. Sorry about all the wrestling. So it was my shampoo and conditioner. This time I got the Ever Pure Smooth Conditioner and Smooth Shampoo. They look like this. They're the ones with the orange. And the, um, the shampoo, sorry, I can't read properly today. The shampoo smells like rosemary and juniper. And the conditioner, rosemary and mint. So. They both have an anti-fade system, there are no harsh salts, and they're natural botanicals. They're also sulfate free, so colored, chemically treated in any way, great for your hair. There's no salt, so it's not going to roughen up your hair, it's going to leave it nice and shiny as you can see. I haven't used it yet, I use others in the brand, but it's along the same line. Next thing I got were the Stylize um, No Snag Hair Elastics. Like that, they don't have the metal part, they're just sort of lie on. I really like these, and I like the fact that they're colorful. Makes me happy. Um, started doing ballet again, hence the reason my hair's in a bun right now. Um, this is the last real hairnet and non holy one I have. So, got hairnets. Not that exciting. Not a lunch lady, I'm not working in the food industry. It's for ballet, it keeps my hair all nice and in together so it doesn't go flying around the place. That's the only reason for it. Next thing I got, let's start with... So it was the Physician's Formula. Where is the actual? I already took it out of the case because I wanted to see what it looked like on me. But it was the Physician's Formula Happy Booster Glow and Mood... Glow and Mood Blue... Blah 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 blah. Glow and Mood Boosting Blush. Say that ten times fast. Anyways, so it's this one right here. It's in the color rose. And if I open it up for you, it looks like that. So there's all sorts of different shades. And it actually smells really pretty. And then you open it up again. And you get this little mirror. And then you also have the brush that's in it. I don't know why it's half one color, half the other. Just the way it is. And I'll show you what the color looks like. I'll put it on my hand. It looks just like that. So it's a very, very hot pink, depending on what colors you use. So if I were to use the side where the hot pink itself was, it's going to look much different. It's going to be much more of a rosy, subdued kind of color. So that's the entire thing all together, almost focusing on the very pink part, and then the other was the other. So that's that. Oops, I forgot to put the brush away. <laughs> where is my head today? Sorry about that, I'm kind of making fun of the girls I'm not a big fan of. Anyways, I shouldn't be doing that, that's not very nice. Next thing I got, again, I've opened it and I've actually already used it once, was the Physician's Formula Eye Booster 2-in-1 Lash Boosting Eyeliner and Serum. So, packaging looks like, looks like this, but I got a bonus. I got the actual black pen. You shake it and it works. That's what I use to do my wings today. I like this side better. It worked out a lot better and looks a lot nicer. And then I also got just Lash Boosting Serum, which you can see right there. It's nice and clear. Supposedly in four weeks I should see thicker, fuller lashes. I will let you guys know if those claims are true. I'm going to try and use at least this one every day, if not this one. Next thing I got, what's the next thing in my bag of goodies? This is sort of a three-in-one. There we go. They are the Rimmel London 
I fall, I gl I fall, I glistener sticks. I don't know. They look like this. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. My camera actually cut out. Um, as I was saying, if you were to use one of these colors underneath the similar color, it would make that one color stand out. So, if that didn't make sense to you, say for instance you're wearing a green eyeshadow at St. Patrick's Day or something, you put this on the bottom and then you start doing the green over top, it's going to make the green stand out a lot more. So yeah, these were $3 each. I got them on sale. They were, I think, probably about 60% off, so I almost got three for the price of one. So I think that's pretty cool. Next thing I got was the Benefit Bella Bambina Box Blush, I think it is. Triple dimen it says on the back. Triple dimensions of pink, brightening, sculpting, and defining. Sweep on the apples of your cheeks and dot at the hairline for a total thrill of dimensional wow. So yeah, it's a blush. I have it on my cheeks right now. Um, you can kind of see it, but I'm going to see what they mean by, so, it's on the apples on my cheeks, and I'm going to do around my hairline. And just blend it back. And I should get the other side too. makes me look like I have a sunburn. So note to self, don't put it around the hairline. Fix my bangs there. So yeah, this was 36 but technically I got it for free or I bought all this stuff and got the, and just paid for this. So I'm happy. Next thing I got, this is a set of four. Well, I may as well show you them as four. They are the Cover Girl Lip Perfection Lipsticks. So four of them. So I'll show you each of the colors that I got. I'm just getting the rest of the stuff out of the bag, so you guys don't have to look at it. Or you guys don't have to hear the crinkly anymore. So the first one I got, it's kind of still on my lips, not really is this sort of corally pink color. It's more of a pink than a coral. Looked more coral in the store. Anyways, it's called Delight. I'll swatch it on my wrist for ya. Oh, I did it on the wrong side. So it's right there. It's a very nice sort of soft muted, really nice color. Next one I got I'm most excited about. I'm gonna actually put this one on my lips to show you guys. It is called Enchantress, and it's this hot bubblegum Barbie pink. <sighs> oh my god. Doesn't really go with what I'm wearing on my face, but I'm gonna do it anyways. So, straight from the tube. But what makes me sad is it was broken. I opened it up and it was broken already. You can see, I don't know if you guys can see inside of it, but yeah, you can see where it broke on the inside. Is that not like the most amazing hot pink color you've ever seen? Kinda reminds me of Nicki Minaj, which I love. I'm making a point to actually start wearing lipsticks on a regular basis. What? I've been watching a lot of Two and a Half Girls, or not Two and a Half Girls, wow, uh, Two Broke Girls. <laughs> too many shows called Two Something. There's Two and a Half Men, Two Broke Girls, etc, etc, etc. It's Two Broke Girls that I've been watching a lot of, so they've been going, what, in the show a lot, so that's where that's been coming from. Excuse me if you don't really like it all that. Next one is this gorgeous purple called Embrace. So if I were to swatch it, I'm actually going to do it on the right side for now, for once. Sexy, freaking, gah, I love it. Last one is this really nice sort of ro dusty rose sort of brown color. 
and if I were to swatch that, it's the one on the bottom there. So as you can see, it really looks like a dusty rose. What I like about these, they're really opaque, but they've got a shine. Um, I'm not sure if you guys can see, but I have, like, I'm prone to, um, what's it called? Oh, cold sores. Can I get them right there? And with these, it hides all sorts of it, all sorts of imperfection. Yeah, right there. Although you can kind of tell this side's a bit thicker than that, but some people's lips are made like that, so I don't care. Last two things I got are, oh, one more thing. This one, simple enough. The Million Lashes Voluminous by L'Oreal. Same one I always use. It's my go-to. Next one is the Revlon Matte Eyeshadow in Velvet Lace, I think. No, Vintage Lace, sorry. It's just this nice matte sort of skin tone. It's a bit lighter than my skin tone, but I have dark skin. This is the job I do. For those of you who don't know, I work at a tanning salon, but I do spray tan, so I look dark. And the last thing I got was the Revlon Color Stay 12 Hour Eyeshadow in Coffee. Sorry, Coffee Bean. So, they just look like that. They're sort of um, a goldish color. A goldish taupe with a bit of shimmer. More of a dark taupe. A true warm brown and a dark, dark brown. So this video is getting long already, I'm sorry about that. Um, that's everything I got from Shoppers Drug Mart. For those of you in the States, like Walgreens and stuff like that. Or CVS. But it's our big chain of drugstores. Um, so yeah, that's everything I got while I was there. And yes, we can get benefit at our drugstores. I don't know about you guys, I haven't really gone through them all that much. So I hope you guys have a great rest of your, your day, and I'll see you later. By the way, I have another video that's probably going to be coming up right away. I'm going to be doing it with the same makeup and my hair exactly the same and everything. And it's an open box from Lixbox. Hope you guys enjoy it. I'll see you guys very soon. Bye.